Good day everyone! I am Nelsa Rosidroso of Marcela T. Mabanta National High School and I am privileged to present to you my research entitled Math Video Lesson, Its Effects on the Academic Performance of the Students in Mathematics Amidst the Pandemic. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought massive changes in all sectors of the community, especially in the education sector. And the sudden transition of education from normal classroom teaching to online modular instruction is very challenging for both students and teachers. The change brought by the pandemic, where face-to-face -face teaching is prohibited and learning is done through online modular, television, and radio to prevent the spread of the virus, causes learners to have much more difficulty understanding mathematics. Moreover, the lack of physical presence of teachers in the teaching and learning process is very difficult for both students and teachers. Students find it hard to understand the concepts of the lesson in the self-learning modules because no teacher discusses and simplifies the lesson for them. They had trouble understanding mathematical terms and they had trouble understanding the processes to get the answers. Meanwhile, the teachers also found themselves in a difficult situation because the discussion of a lesson is very important to ensure the learning of the students. But due to the current situation, it no longer applies. So, learning is difficult for students. In recent years, mathematics has always been a rock at the bottom of the eight subjects at the Marcella Mubanta National High School. This value has not changed for quite some time. No matter how hard teachers try to simplify teaching, math is always at its lowest. This makes mathematics one of the subjects with the lowest percentage of test scores. In fact, mathematics is included in the bottom three in terms of the average percentage score in the last academic year. Therefore, in this pandemic period, a teacher must make math concepts or lessons easy for their students. Mathematics teachers must create or use strategies where mathematics subjects can still be easily taught to students as if the teacher was with them. The new normal in education goes
to students during the weekly distribution and retrieval schedule of tablets and self-learning module and it was administered to the respondents before the implementation of the enter. Before the implementation of the teacher-produced instructional video lesson, the respondents had average skills at answering the given problems. While after the implementation of the video lesson, the respondents had mastered the problems posed. In terms of score variability, the standard deviation of the pretest was greater than the standard deviation of the post -test. This demonstrates that after the treatment, the post-test was less scattered because most of the learners received a higher score compared to the pre-test whose scores were more scattered. It is supported by the claim of Booster in his study which showed a statistically significant increase in math achievement scores when students use video than when they do.
future researchers may develop a method or mechanism to check whether it is actually the respondents who answered the questionnaire to obtain a valid study result.